I'm Mike Helgren at Great Mills High School. This is the first day back at class for students since the deadly shooting here two weeks ago when 16-year-old Jalen Willie was killed by a fellow student, her ex-boyfriend, and a 14-year-old student, uh, Desmond Barnes, was also shot. Uh, he is out of the hospital after that. Um, there's a visible presence here of sheriff's deputies, uh, several vehicles out front, and along Great Mills Road here, there are several flags uh, that, are, that were put up to support the students who are heading back to class here today. We talked to one parent about how emotional it was for her. She says that uh, her son was allowed back in for an hour a few days ago just to, to look around. And she said that she saw him always looking behind his back worried. She said he was nervous about heading back to class today, but she feels that he is secure here. And she says it's still hard for her to believe that this school was the site of a shooting. Uh, there was a deputy, if you'll remember in this case, who uh, opened fire on the shooter and it, it, in the end the sheriff determined that the shooter took his own life but the deputy was able to shoot almost simultaneously and he actually they say hit the gun that was in the shooter's hand a lot of people called him a hero because of this we're gonna have more today on WJZ about the students first day back how they're healing how they're coping after the shooting here again two weeks ago today back to you